Welcome to OSU Extension Marion County with Tim Barnes as we further explore applying liquid swine manure to growing corn in the V4 and V5 stage. So is there a way to apply liquid swine manure in an economical way and still extend the, the window of application and reduce the damage to a growing corn crop? This application is being made with a 55 foot splash bar. Note the applicator is running on a 45 degree angle to the growing corn rows. Approximately 7,000 gallons of liquid swine manure is being applied per acre. In these longer pulls, the, the hose tends to roll as it moves over the top of the crop. But again, note the ridges tend to protect the corn as the hose moves over it. Let's look closer at the possible damage to the growing corn plants. Yes, there is visible damage to some of the plants. And as we start looking at drone footage, you can see the diagonal application pattern that uh, provides a good view of the entire field. The tractor applicator's footprint is 14 feet. And as we took stand counts in that 14-foot area, the average plant population was 19,500 plants per acre. Visiting the field seven days after application uh, shows visible damage by the tractor tires to the plants in its path. Uh, some plants were stunted, some actually were killed. As you review the plants that were not affected by the tractor tires, they exhibit uh, normal population, normal color, and, and normal vigor. As we analyze the whole field on its population, uh, it was reduced to pro approximately 2,000 plants uh, per acre. Uh, we plan to revisit this field and summarize our findings after harvest.